Hello, friends. How are you today? I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today's book. Oh, my name is Henriette, and this is Reading with Mama. Today's book is going to be a National Geographic Kids Wildcats by Elizabeth Carney. <clears throat> Meet the cats. Wild cats aren't like house cats. Most wild cats live in the wild places. They're found all over the world. Scientists have counted 35 species of wild cats. Let's meet some. Fun word. Species, a group of related living things. Some wild cats are called big cats. The lion is a big cat. So are tigers, leopards, and jaguars. See? Big cats. Cats of the world. Some cats live in open grasslands. They're fast and powerful. They must be quick to chase animals across the grass. We have an African wild cat, a verbat, oh, excuse me, serval, and cheetahs. Margays live in the rush in the lush rainforest of Central Africa. See, this is a margay right here. Kind of looks like a cheetah, right? Wildcats also live in jungles and forests. Some are good at climbing trees. Many jungle cats enjoy swimming. Sometimes they even catch fish. Why are cats good at video games? The question and answer. The answer is because they have nine lives. <laughs> here we have a tiger. And here we have a jaguar. See, they look similar. But this is a margay. This is a jaguar. You can see the differences in their pattern here. See? Wild cats can be found in cold too. They often live in snowy mountains. These cats have thick fur to keep them warm. Their wide paws act like snowshoes. A Eurasian lynx has thick fur on its wide feet. This helps walk. This helps it walk in the steep snow. See, this is a snow leopard. And a Eurasian lynx. This is a Eurasian lynx here. And this is a snow leopard. See the ears? Cool, right? Only one type of wild cat makes it home in the desert. Meet the sand cat. It can live for months without drinking. It gets water from the food it eats. <laughs> Another question and answer riddle. What's a cat's favorite song? Three blind mice. <laughs> and then this is the sad cat that lives in the desert. It's eating a snake. So whatever um, water is in the snake that's how the cat gets its water the sand cat it's beautiful a cat up close wild cats live in many different habitats but they have some things in common let's check out the body parts that cats have our fur word 
here is habitats and animals natural home so let's look at the cat up close here we have ears can hear many sounds that humans can hear the nose has a powerful sense of smell teeth are long and sharp whiskers help cats find their way in the dark claws curve into sharp points Seven cool facts about wild cats. One, all big cats roar. They do not purr the way other wild cats do. Two, cheetahs are the world's fastest land animals. They can reach 65 miles an hour in seconds. Big cats don't roar. <clears throat> Excuse me. Big cats don't just roar. They also make a purr-like sound called a chuffle. Oh, I didn't even know that. It's their way of saying hello. Four, many wildcats cat, can catch animals that are more than twice their size. Five, rusty spotted cats are the smallest wild cats. They weigh about three pounds. Tigers are the biggest cats. They can weigh up to 660 pounds. Wow, those are big cats. Sand cats have thick fur on their paws. This helps them walk in sand without sinking. And seven, snow leopards are great leapers. They can jump as far as 20 feet. Those are seven cool facts. You were right. Built to hunt. A cheetah chases its prey. All cats eat meat. Wild cats must hunt for their food. They catch other animals. This is hard work. Many cats run fast and chase their prey. Others sneak up on it. Others sneak up on it. I tried to whisper that. But I just wanted to make sure you heard what I said. Our fur word here is prey, an animal that is eaten by other animal. Prey. See, and that's the cheetah chasing its prey. Can you spot the cat in this picture? It's not easy. Wild cats are great at hiding. They don't want their prey to see them and run away. Wild cats use camouflage to blend in. That's our fur word, camouflage, an animal's color or pattern that helps it hide from other animals. And we have another question and answer. What game did the cat like to play with the mouse? And this is a Canada Lynx. You see it there? Camouflage. Caring for cubs. Wild cats give birth to cubs. Young cubs drink milk from their mothers. Mothers teach their cubs how to hunt. When the cats are old enough, they go off and live on their own. So we have a tiger mother and her cub, a lion cub here, and we have a young cougar with her babies. See? Young cougar cubs with their mother. Wild cat question and answer. Kids like you asked about wild cats. This is what they wanted to know. Why do cats scratch? Well, cats must keep their claws sharp and clean, so they scratch tree bark. It's like a scratching post for them. 
what side of a cat has the most fur? <laughs> this is the joke. The outside. <laughs> Do some wild cats live in the wild? Yes. They're called feral cats. They're the same species as house cats, but they act more like wild cats. Why can't wild cats live in people's homes? Wild cats wouldn't make good pets. They need to hunt and roam large areas. They can also be dangerous. So here we have the European wild cats, a house cat, a feral cat, and a caracal. See that? See, that's a wild cat. You see how angry it looks and hungry? You can't have a cat like that while cats living in your home. It's dangerous. Wild cats and people. Some people move into lands where wild cats live. This causes problems. The cats have less space to live and hunt in the wild. They might hunt people's farms instead of farm people's, I'm sorry. They might hunt people's farm animals instead. The people want to protect their animals. A bobcat walks in a large park in Los Angeles, California, USA. Farmers in South Africa sometimes use traps to keep wild cats from their animals. See the traps? If they didn't put these traps, all of these animals, farm animals, will get eaten up by the wild cats. Helping hands. A Maasai man tracks lions for a special program in Africa. The program helps keep people and lions safe. An Iberian lynx is set out in the wild. <clears throat> Some people are studying wild cats. They help them learn how to protect the cats. Others are working on how to keep cats' habitats safe. We can work together to share the world with wild cats. What in the world? These pictures show up close views of things in wild cats' world. Use the hints to figure out what's in the pictures. Answers are on page 31. Okay. So, the first hint is help these help wild cats find their way in the dark. That's the first hint. The second hint, wild cats give birth to these. Do you know what that is? Cubs. Yes. And the first one is, these help wild cats find their way in the dark. Their whiskers. They actually have um, like sensors in their whiskers, which helps them see better in the dark. Very interesting, huh? Hint number three, wild cats keep these sharp and clean. Do you know what they are? They're claws, yes. This helps a wild cat balance. Can you see in this picture what helps the wild cat balance? The tail, yes. The tail helps them um, maneuver. Maneuver means um, how to move. So it helps them keep their balance and when they're running, it helps them balance as they're running to catch their prey. And this keeps wild cats warm. Do you see that? Their fur, very good. And only one type of wild cat lives here.
Do you remember which wildcat this is? The sand cat, very good. The desert, they live in the desert. Okay, let's go over some of our fur words. Camouflage, an animal's color or pattern that helps it hide from other animals. Habitat, an animal's natural home. Prey, an animal that is eaten by another animal. Species, a group of related living things. And that is the end of our book. I hope you enjoyed that. Um, I love reading about um, nature. So I will be reading more books like this. It's going to have fun facts. Uh, and you will learn about um, not just wild animals, but I will also be reading about domestic animals. Domestic animals means animals that, live, that can live in the home. Wild animals are animals that live outside in the world. I hope you enjoyed that, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye, friends.